Amy coming at you from Living Our Best Life. This video is all about my friend LaDawn. We are finally, after COVID, is starting to settle down, hopefully, cross our fingers, won't hold our breath. Um, a Christmas present that she bought for her and I to share to do a float spa in the salt. So this is about my soul sister LaDawn. It's kind of weird. We've not known each other for very long, a few years, and it seems like we've known each other forever. Um, we're both crazy. We both have crazy families, um, which everybody does, but it's just really weird how we have so many similarities um, with our mothers and our families and just everything. It's really crazy. So on this day, the first thing we did is we went to a place called Stacked and we got veggie burgers on gluten-free buns because friends buy you food. This burger was absolutely amazing to be a veggie burger on a gluten-free bun. Um, to me, it tasted like a Whopper did when I would eat a Whopper back in the day. So this is a picture of this veggie burger on the gluten-free bun from Stacked Restaurant. And I'll put that in the comments below um, the place that we were at in Wexford. Um, at this restaurant. That was pretty cool. And then up next is our float spa. So hi, it's Amy from Living Our Best Life. I'm whispering, I don't know why. I'm in a room um, and this is the perfect float. Me and my friend LaDawn, she got me this for Christmas and um, we're finally getting to do it because of COVID. So I just wanted to show you the room real quick. So you basically, I'll tell you more about it, but you basically have to take a shower first and then you get into this pod, which I'll show you the pod. And then, um, yeah, you just basically float. You float in really, really salty water. It's supposed to be good for all kinds of things. So I don't know what to expect, but I have to take a five to seven minute shower first. So I'm getting ready to do that. Okay, so this is the pod. I honestly wasn't feeling good with a little bit before I came in here and I didn't even eat my lunch. But I feel like, ooh, rejuvenated. 
So after our salt bath, soak, float, whatever, we got to sign the pod squad wall. And then this is a picture of the whole wall of everybody's signatures. Um, I don't know how long they've had this wall up, but it's a lot of signatures that have floated in the pods. The next thing we did was an oxygen bar. And these had different essential oils in them. And Dawn is over on the other side. She had different scents than I did. So she's over there putting on her little cannula for her oxygen bar. And I think it was like we did it for like 12 minutes or whatever. So we're getting a essential oil oxygen treatment. Dawn doesn't have any makeup on. <laughs> and we're drinking this really good tea. Chamomile, vanilla, honey. Try it once, I guess. This is the room. We were back that hall, and then in there's where you can use lotions and stuff like that. Pretty cool. Different scents, blackberry vanilla, serenity, vanilla bean, and fresh cranberry. And this was some absolutely yummy tea that they had in this very heavy, actually, it's like a cast iron um, teapot, but this honey vanilla chamomile tea was really, really good. Um, yeah. And I'm not a really big tea drinker. Dawn likes tea, but it was really, really good. We enjoyed it. Next coming up are the benefits. They had a little card on the table of the benefits um, of floating. So, yeah, this actually says the long-term benefits. But I wish that we had one closer to where we live because I felt absolutely amazing after um, I floated for an hour and got out of the pod. Um, so yeah, there's definitely proof in the pudding of this different alternative therapy of floating and very, um, salty or high salinity water. So how do you feel, LaDawn, after your float spa? I won't put you on camera because I know you don't got your makeup on. <laughs> I feel amazing. I feel relaxed and less stressed and not tired. Yeah, I was afraid I was going to feel tired. Yeah. But I got out of there, I was like... Yeah. I love the shower. Yeah. <laughs> the shower was great, too. The shampoo smells good, too. Mm-hmm. It's great. I put a whole bunch of conditioner in because I was afraid it was going to be, like, dry from the salt. Because when I felt that, like, coming up on my neck and stuff, I was like, oh, yeah, this is going to be salty. I did get salt in my nose. Mm -hmm. and then I, was like, I didn't use the earplugs. You didn't? No. I did put the earplugs in. No. They felt like bubble gum. It was like bubble gum. <laughs> I, I put them in. Like, yeah, you mush them. <laughs> and then I took them out. <laughs> it was like bubble gum. Yeah. I feel like it my face great. is hot though. Does your face feel hot? No. Actually, it's nice and cool. Yeah, your face is warm. Feel mine? It feels warm. It does. <laughs> to me, but it's not very warm. <laughs> Mine feels hot, like in the sun, hot. It was great. Definitely go back. Yes. Yeah, that's a good deal. I mean, really, you can't beat that. No. Hmm. They had a deal, but we don't live close enough to get the deal to use it, really. So. Oh, well. We'll come back, just not be a member. Have all kinds of deals to you on like group on and stuff or I'll have Just to go and like them on, on Facebook, Facebook page. Yeah. would do it again loved it true best float spa so what I'm gonna tell you to take from this is it's not about floating in the water or going out to lunch it's about 
God placing people in your life. So make sure that you don't build walls. Make sure that you allow people in so you're not missing out on being blessed by a soul sister, a best friend, um, anybody that God wants to put in your life to live your best life to the fullest. Don't forget to go subscribe. Hit the bell.